Cheers, everybody. Welcome to another episode of Coffee Time. It's Wednesday, it's Wednesday morning. And in fact, I'm running a little late. I need to get going. Um, so I'm going to shoot for a um, espresso this morning to wake me up and, and get me going. And uh, unfortunately, won't have a lot of time to enjoy this. But hopefully you can enjoy your coffee uh, today. Um, as always, we do a coffee every Wednesday, and this one's super exciting because it is very difficult to um, find espresso in the grocery stores here in Texas. I have to order my espresso. So anytime we travel and we can pick up espresso um, overseas, it is a big deal for us because... Um, it's inexpensive and it's different and we love espresso. We love making espresso or mocha pots all the time. Uh, maybe uh, making some cappuccinos or Americanos or something like that. But this is one that you can order online. Um, I don't know uh, what the shipping is going to be on this. But this is the Masella uh, de Cafe Machinado. The... Uh, Capricio, Capricio, I don't know if you can see the word here, it's in silver, coffee. It's from Manuel. This is an Italian coffee uh, company. My wife actually bought this in Morocco, though, uh, and this is the first time we've ever tried it. The uh, cost of this is about six pounds. Um, I converted that to American. It should have been euros, but for some reason it gave me pounds. And so if it's six pounds, then it's going to be, it's the website. If you go to English, it gives you pounds. So I think they ship freely to England. Um, it said six pounds. So this is about seven and a half, eight, nine dollars, about nine dollars here in the U.S. if you can get it. Um, and they have a whole bunch of different flavors. Like I say, it's an espresso. It's very dark. <clears throat> they do a, um, a little uh, darkness scale back here. Um, everything is really, really, really dark. It's also nothing in this is in English. So you have to go to the web page and convert it. And it gives you a little bit more information than trying to decipher this, but not as much as on the can. It's got languages in um, I mean, a whole bunch of different languages, just not English. But I do know it's 100% Arabica. Now, they do a bunch of Arabica Robusta mixes, but this one is 100% Arabica, I believe. Now, some of you always like to correct me on stuff like that, so please do if you know this is a mix. But from what I could tell, <clears throat> it's 100% Arabica. <clears throat> oh, I better get some coffee. I'm getting a little frog in my throat. Oh, gorgeous color, nice and chocolatey dark. Um, it was a pressure seal can when I opened it. It just smelled so good. Uh, woo. Very earthy, very dark, very um, nutty. Doesn't smell too um, acidic. It's a nice smell. I'm going to have to take this can to work and not tell my wife. Because we have uh, espresso almost every day at work. It's super hot. And that's probably a double shot there. And I made a full pot. I don't know why I made a full pot. Probably make an Americano to go. Slight bitterness. Slight acidity. But um, kind of a... a mushroomy, earthy, nutty tones to it. So, um, classic <clears throat> Italian espresso to me. Uh, this is something I would put a little bit of sugar in, um, the brown raw sugar. And maybe a touch of cream. It's a little bit too dark. So if I do make an Americano with this, <clears throat> which is a shot or maybe two shots of espresso and then hot water, uh, that's what you get as an Americano if you're in Europe. And then uh, probably a little bit of uh, Italian sweet cream. It's tasty. It's good. I definitely don't want to waste this, so I'm going to make uh, probably actually put this in a thermos and take it to work and have a couple shots with my friends. So, um, sounds like I'm drinking whiskey, doesn't it? But no, 
espresso. Um, but tell us what you think. Um, this is one of our most popular episodes every Wednesday. And so people out there that are watching the channel, you guys are really into coffee as well as the whiskeys. Um, but go ahead and please leave some comments below. Can you get this in the U.S.? Um, I can get this because I can order it to my, uh, my kids that live in England. But I do believe you can uh, order this and get it uh, shipped to the U.S., but tell me if uh, I'm wrong. Uh, but tell me what you think. Uh, this is the Capricillo. So let me know about any other ones out there that you've tried from Manuel. Uh, I definitely um, pick up espresso every time I can. Uh, the dogs are barking because they're telling me it's time to go to work. So I will let you um, go for the day, and we'll see you tomorrow for whiskey. Have a great Wednesday. Cheers. Mm-hmm. <laughs>